What we wanted to do was replicate the 32 weeks of training that Royal Marines go through. So we put together um, the, the most testing snippets from the training to try and give a taster of what Marines go through and they certainly had that this weekend. John and all the guys with him who are, who are serving an ex-Marines know exactly what's entailed. Do take care doing this. I mean, I spent an hour last night waterproofing everything of mine. Well, day one, they were appalling. There was 50 mile an hour winds and very cold rain. Um, and we continued. They were still abseiling right down the cliff. Oh, I don't like it. It was just, I guess it was fun, it was a challenge. What we were doing was really scary, but I kind of thought, well, if you're going to do this, you may as well do this with a group of professionals. I feel like I've learned that I can do a lot more than I thought I could. Like, I never thought I could have walked like 10k with a Bergen on. Originally I thought, oh, not sure, but you can't say no to kind of opportunities like this. It's a really special moment getting your Green Beret. It's the end of a really tough journey, and you become, you know, Royal Marines family uh, as the charity are part of that, and our cadets are part of that, and our retired community. But you know, the real core of that are, is the moment of getting that Green Beret, you know, and the, the special moment that that represents. Yeah.